Who sung this episode? What do you mean? I don't what know. What up, though? No. Uh, usually we have banter beforehand. Oh. There's no more goats. Yeah, we ain't got no ghost story. We ain't got no lizard Can story. Can I get my sweater? But yeah, we ain't got no ghost story, uh-huh. we ain't got no lizard story, we ain't got no roach story, we ain't got no bird story. <laughs> I mean, I, I, don't, I don't even know how to stuff episodes no more. We ain't got none of them. Yeah. We're just busy. We do have one story. Vacation? Sure. That's not it. No, they have nothing. Oh, it was the one story. I was nothing, like, what is nothing. it? Nothing. 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 We have a vacation coming up, so. We do have a vacation coming up. We did, that's going to be part of the... One of the, the parties. The week. Smoky Mountains get the kids involved. It's news of the week. Hold on. Oh, Hold on. sorry. Hold on. You ready? I'm ready. To another episode of Taking the Stage. Mm-hmm. I'm the math guy Steve. This is Pagey Baby. Pagey Wagey Pagey Babe. Babe? Yes. How's your day going? How's what's the news of the day? News of the week? Man. And today is it's funny because this morning Brittany put something on uh TT, shout out. TT. She put something on um social media about being Monday and like beast mode and stuff like that. And I was like, I uh, chatted and I was like, I don't know, this is like the Mondayest of Mondays for me. <laughs> so that's how it has been the entire day. I'm always, you know, thankful and grateful that I'm here and I'm you know, I have all my abilities and faculties and stuff like that, but I'm tired. <laughs> That's the craziest part is that... I've been nonstop all day. Yeah. The craziest part is that usually it's because of school mm-hmm. or it's because of, you know, other stuff that we have going on. Mm-hmm. But today was supposed to be an empty day, an empty slot. Yeah. And it's kind of... Yeah. No. No, nah, it's not how today ended up. Yeah. But... We're busy with the kids. Mm-hmm. And mom is here today. Yeah. Helping out. And we rearranged their room and all that stuff, yeah, so... Yeah, cleaned their room, rearranged you know. it. And then, yeah, it's just been a busy... Uh-huh. Monday's going Monday. It don't matter what you got going on. It's really supposed to be going on. Monday is yes. still on Monday. Yes. Uh, so yeah, but it's been a good good day, good good week, uh, good good weekend. I was about to say how was Shout out TT. Uh, we had church at, at um, yes. B. Sheree, Thank you so um, much, Studios, B. Sheree. Mm-hmm. Uh, which we actually, and it's open for like I was just events. About to say, we will be podcasting there. Soon yeah, it's like day. a it's a but B. Sheree, um it's. Not only wedding planning, but she can she uses her space as like you know a um, a workspace mm-hmm. for people to I guess come and like rent out a, mm-hmm. you know workspace office space and stuff like that um, events Event like center. birthday parties dinners like you mm-hmm. know little things functions and we were able to have our church service last week there yeah so we were able to see a lot of the members from New who Orleans who yeah who kinda... can't. Travel to, yeah, the services. So, yeah, yeah. Shout out, shout out. We have to ask her to write us like a little snippet of what she wants us to say when we talk about it. So, we can like call that a commercial page. Yeah. Uh, This is ad. Like, insert ad. So, we'll ask her so we can insert it with her like logo and stuff. We don't have her permission yet to do that. But, (laughs) so, yeah, so shout out to her. Shout out to her for sure. That's how I should have started off this episode. Uh huh. So, I'll probably just cut this and put it in front. Uh, we were talking earlier, it was yesterday, the day before, and uh, we were watching regular uh, Hulu or, or Paramount or something, Paramount. Uh-huh. Uh, we were watching the show and a commercial comes on. And Mel says, Daddy, skip the ad, skip the ad. <laughs> My mind, I was like, Oh, she doesn't even call that a commercial. She right. Even know what a commercial she has is. no idea what a commercial is. She thinks they're ads. Wow. Everything's an ad. That's mm-hmm. crazy. Okay, so yes. You gotta wait for the ad. Yeah, wait for the <laughs> She ad. knows how to press a little ad <laughs> on the apps. Mm-hmm. So, we'll definitely have an ad for B. B- Sheree yeah. sooner rather than later for sure and be shooting episodes of the podcast there as well. Yes. With her. Yes. Um, but she's just a great time. We talked about she this. She really is. That, yeah, that, go back and look at our good, top five. Right, yeah, right. Or top 20 for her. She'd be, she'd be <laughs> 
She don't keep up with the rules. Uh, but yeah, but it was a great week for me. Great. Um, uh, I finally so you finished school last week. I finally uh-huh. finished yesterday. Actually, yes. I put in the final grades yesterday. Um, so now it's just off until um January. But you know, we got yeah, a lot of stuff, coming stuff coming up. Though. Yeah, we got a lot coming up. We got well the vacation next week. That was uh, a small opportunity, but we'll talk about that later. Okay. That I'll be that I'll be working on. Yes. I still have my Sunday class that I teach mm-hmm. online. There's always something it's over just, here. It's never, never, never stopping. <laughs> yeah. Know? Never even slow down. It's never right? a true break, yeah. Yeah, so. But that's okay. That's how we do it. That's how we mm-hmm. do it. That's a, uh, well, but we do people. have the vacation. Yes. So at least we have that. Yes. And we'll be pretty excited to, we'll, we'll set that time apart, uh, aside just Yeah, for, to just try to be like intentional about the mm-hmm. personal time. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. So today's episode, okay. what I want us to do is so make it lighthearted, fun. Uh, randomly, I saw on some show uh, they oh actually it was a podcast that we were watching, and okay. um, I saw that they just even though that wasn't the topic that they were going uh-huh. over, but they wanted to start. They said we should do an episode on trivia of a certain show. Okay. So I went to well. Most the shows that I think we know the most. Yeah. So we'll do Martin and Fresh Prince trivia. Okay. Let's okay. see. Oh, then... let's see. All right. You think you got it? I think so. It's 30 questions each. I don't 30 know if we get through all 30. Yeah, yeah. No, we got to cut that down. <laughs> My mama got to go. You're right. 29 each. We'll go to 29 Steven. each. Okay. All right. All right. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try it. Okay. Okay. That's not it. That's that's. that's... I was waiting. Pills game. Waiting. Oh, 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 shut up, man. Go Pels, man. Take flight. You know what I mean, man? Shut up, guy. <laughs> shut up, Z. I'm cover my shirt up. Ah, okay. okay. <laughs> who that is? After that? last still, week. Still who that, bro? Still who that? Oh, I'm wearing red. Oh. <laughs> red and black. All right. Okay. Martin Trivia. Let's do it. Let's try it. Let's try it. Okay. First All question. Right. First question. Let's see mm-hmm. what we got. What type of car did Cole drive? A Pacer. A Pacer. Not the Pacer. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Big Shirley was in my Pacer. <laughs> Yes, it was a pacer, yes. Because we'll drove with AMC <laughs> Pacer. If it's one thing he loved more than Big Shirley uh-huh. <laughs> and Chicken Fingers. It was his pacer. Was his pacer. That's hilarious. <laughs> and I don't even know what that means. What? I've never seen, I don't know what a pacer is. That's a real car? Oh, I, I actually, I don't, sure. I don't know either. I don't know either. Well, so we have to remember that we, though this is, uh, we yeah, grew we up in the 90s. Yeah, we were watching it, but yeah. It, we were, very we were kids, yeah, yeah. So, so we just, reruns is kind of how we right. got mm-hmm. to know these characters, not really... From being that age. Okay. Who was Martin's girlfriend? Okay. Gina. Damn. Gina. I mean, damn, Gina. <laughs> Mercy. <laughs> dang, Gina. Yes, yeah, of course it was Gina. Gina Waters was played by Tisha Campbell. Uh-huh. Little James was Gina's best friend. Uh, Sinead was Martin's annoying neighbor. We lived across the hall from mm-hmm. him. And Big Shirley was Cole's overweight girlfriend. Okay, got it. Um, Where do Martin and his friends live when the series started? Ooh, okay. Where Detroit. Detroit. Does- Oh, I didn't know they meant the city. I thought you meant where did every person, each person live in comparison in to the next. Yeah. Who lived with who? Martin was on his own okay. at the beginning. Gina lived with Pam. Mm-hmm. Cole lived on his own. And, oh, Cole lived with his mama. Mm-hmm. And then Tommy, who don't got a job, he lives somewhere. <laughs> uh, Tommy, no job having but. But I just. I. Is it Detroit? Really? But I think they just wanted Detroit. They probably did. I was overthinking. Because, remember, wait the hell up, Detroit. <laughs> <laughs> I say that to the kids all the time. <laughs> so. You're ridiculous. Uh, yes. And then in the end, they lived in LA. Chicago. Yes, Lord. Stephen. No, didn't Gina move to Los Angeles? Yeah, but I think. Job, and then, the, like, the last episode, Martin was moving with her. He told her that he was going to move there, too. Well, I don't know. That may just be where it was like filmed. Oh, it says the later was set in Chicago. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. to me those two are the same thing. Okay, Stan left the radio station because he was being pursued by the IRS. He sold the station to who? The country people. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> uh, it was WZUP, so it was like a uh, yeehaw. Yeah. Um, the country station. Yeah, that's country, what I, that's yeah, why yeah, I'm yeah, leaving yeah. it. Yeah, the country station. Yeah. Red McMaster's. Okay. Red McMaster's purchased the radio station from Stan, hoping Martin would mix hip hop and country. Yes, 
it did not work, and Martin, after verbally abusing Red, was fired. Uh-huh. Brian Reddy played Red. Okay. All right, let's see here. What was the name of the mechanic who loved to burst out into the song? Mm. Not Jerome. Uh, it definitely wasn't Jerome. Don't you? No, no. I'm about to say, at least no song. At least you got to know the song. Stan? No, no, his name wasn't Stan. Stan was the Yeah. Man. Don't you know no good? Don't you I'm gonna know go no with good? Mr. Don't you know no good? Yes. That is not the correct <laughs> name. But you know who I'm talking about, so I'm still right, technically. Yes, okay. Elroy, Elroy. Preston. <laughs> I didn't know that one either. I ain't gonna look at Elroy Preston. Okay, got it. All right, I'm not gonna read the synopsis every time. Okay. All right. Is the synopsis? Yeah. Extra portion. Okay. Little summary, yeah. Who are Martin's two best friends? Tommy and Cole. Tommy and Cole. Tommy and Cole. Uh, Pam. <laughs> <laughs> Pamela James. <laughs> and Shanene. I right, know Tommy go for it. Okay. When Martin got fired, he picked up a plastic garbage can and threw it against the window, screaming what? That's very specific. I remember the scene. When he got fired. Which time? No. No, no, no. This is because the... Cause from the, the TV station? I mean, from the radio station? Yeah, because the, the can bounced off the window. It didn't break through. Um, so I remember the scene, but I'm trying to think of what he said. I don't know. Uh, I'm stumped on that one. I, I had a good trajectory going, but I don't know that one. I can't I can't think of it right now. Let's see. Radio! Okay, okay. Mario Radio, because he said, I thought it was cool when Spike did it in the movie. That movie was Do the Right Thing. Okay. Yeah, seen, that seen was seen very right particular. Thing. I wouldn't have guessed that. So, yeah. But I, I do remember him saying that. It's just I couldn't... I remember seeing uh, It was directed by Spike Lee and Martin was also a lead in the movie. The episode? No. Do the right oh, thing. The- <laughs> I was like, Spike Lee directed the episode? Okay. No, but Martin was a lead in the movie. In the movie, yeah. Gotcha. Okay, see. What comments does Pam make to Martin that get him to talk back? What comments does hmm? Pam make to Martin that get him? I don't get this question. Me either. I see. She says she, he's real short. Oh, that's, that's just a generic. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Whoa, whoa, hold up! Don't be threatening us with the physical because I, I can get down with the big boys. Who did Martin say this to? The basketball team? Don't be threatening us with the physical. I get down with the big boys. I'm trying to... The basketball team? No, no. You talking about the WNBA players? Yeah. No. What is he? No, I don't think he... Um... Because he has so many famous people on, Martin. Right? I know this is a guest character. Guest characters, maybe. But Oh, Tommy. Mm. Mm. I was way off. <laughs> right. In the episode where Martin lost the CD player. Oh. That episode was so oh. funny with the dog. The, dog. <laughs> Bruh. the funniest part about that is that if you go back and watch that, uh, or even the. How everybody was laughing. Breaking the. Well, not only, yeah, breaking character, mm-hmm. but also uh, they're supposed to have a real dog. Oh, yeah. They said it at the reunion. At the reunion, mm-hmm. yeah. They said reunion. I've, I've seen other documentaries where they said that, but yeah, it was supposed to be a real dog. And. Because of whatever happened, they they wouldn't, they couldn't have a real dog on the actual episode. Right. So Martin just said, "No, no, no, we're gonna we're gonna just get me a fake one. That's fine." And he was gonna make it happen essentially. That was so funny. Hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> stay, stay. And then he walked away. And that dog <laughs> fell. Oh, and he was dragging. He was like, <laughs> "Sit." <laughs> oh man. Okay. Who are, who are my best friends? Who said that already? Okay. Gotcha. okay. okay. Have a great day. Okay. <laughs> you got the verses in the middle of the day. Okay, trivia. Martin and Gina are rich. They have won the lottery, or so they think. Martin gives gifts to all his friends. What does he give Pam? A wax certificate. <laughs> oh my goodness, yes. Uh two thousand dollars wax job. Wax job. <laughs> um who was Martin's nemesis in high school? Ooh. Uh, the short man, right? Oh, oh no, not Tommy Davidson, though. He was in high school. Tony, am I thinking, or am I thinking Mark and Kids? It's two names. It's a description and then a name. It's like, uh, pretty, 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 pretty Ricky? Pretty Ricky, what they call it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> pretty Ricky, what they yeah. call it. 
But that was played by um, who? Juana Man. Oh, okay. Nah, I don't know his name. Pretty Ricky, what they call. Pretty Ricky, what they call. Uh, Ricky Fontaine. Mm-hmm. Uh, according to Martin, who? Uh, how does Pam get special attention at her job? What? I don't know. I don't know this one. She wears a red dress. Okay. I don't know. Martin and Gina had a joint uh, a checking account. Martin used the money in the account to purchase a very large television. What did Gina use the money to purchase? Ah, oh, I know this. I know he had to bring the TV back, and she bought the bread maker. Remember she bought like Buku stuff. No, the bread maker was season one stuff. No, oh. No, no. Oh, oh was that when she? Uh, no, 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 I think that's something else. Like got her car fixed or something? No. Hmm. I remember the episode. I think she bought some shoes. Something like that. Huh? Oh, the Donna Karens. I think so. I think that was it. I think she, I think many shoes. I oh, said bread maker. Bread maker. I said bread that. Bread <laughs> yeah, because afterwards, then he brought her the bread maker, and he and she brought him the TV. Uh huh. But then she also, or something like that. And then they had enough money. Somebody, one of them had enough money mm-hmm. to get two of the things. Okay. Who is Martin's biggest arch rival throughout the show? Shanene. I think so. Oh, Pam. Yeah. 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 Oh, Shanene was Gino's. Yes. How did Martin make up for his big mouth behavior for telling secrets? Oh, when he told everybody secrets that episode... They have to dress up as something. I don't remember what episode they're talking about. He told everybody the secrets that episode. And they're saying he couldn't like hold water basically. I think he had to dress up as something. He had to embarrass himself in some manner. He was supposed to tell one of his own personal secrets. Oh, already. okay. Oh, okay, now okay, yeah. This is earlier season one and two, yeah. The big secret he had was that he tried to sleep with Shanene, but she wouldn't answer the door. Sorry. <laughs> okay, let's see. Pam had a boyfriend that had his own skybox. <laughs> In the <this> skybox. <laughs> Me. You. Oh, wait. What was his name? Okay, I want to say it. Oh, what was his name? Me. And Mr. Skybox. That's what I'm going to go with. No, it's not Mr. Skybox. Well, okay, like what does it start with? That, that. <laughs> Me. Mm. Right? No, not Randall. Not Randy. Me. I don't remember either. Dang. But well, we know what episode it is. Simon. Simon. Me. In the sky. Simon. Bye. In the sky. Bye. <laughs> All right, let's see. Which character on Martin wasn't too bright? Cole, Cole. and his girlfriend. Cole. And something on his table. That's a lot. Cole and his girlfriend, yes. That's for sure. Okay, what was Gina's boss's name? I don't know. This one you can say Mr. something because it is Mr. Yeah, something. Mr. Boss Man. Hey, Mr. Whitaker. Mm. Michael Collier. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, what was the name of Shanae's hair salon? I don't know. Got to go to work on my Shanae oh, show enough enough hair, hair salon. salon. I feel like we've answered these questions. Got to go to work on our feet. Not on the podcast, though. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh. What is Martin's last name? Payne. Yeah, it's Payne. Okay, that's easy. Okay, what did Gina lose? And had to work for shenanigans to get replacements. Tickets. Martin's tickets. Mm-hmm. That he look he sold from a radio station. Right. <laughs> you got to go to work on Myra Feet. <laughs> you got to go to work on Myra Feet. Pistons tickets, yeah. Uh, who killed Mama Payne's bird? Gina. Not, Not my, my mama, mama bird. bird. <laughs> Not my mama bird. Not my mama bird. <laughs> How do I? <laughs> yeah, Gina killed uh, uh, Mama Bird. At what point in the show, Mar- at one point in the show, Martin mm-hmm. got a $4,000 investment and wanted to build a restaurant with the money. What did he call the restaurant? I want to say Reynolds Home. <laughs> it's not Reynolds was, It was, um, <laughs> what were they selling? Um, so it's, it's, I'm not thinking of Martin Kids. Think, yeah, you're thinking of Martin Kids. Uh, instead chicken of, and waffles. Chicken, instead of chicken and waffles, it was, uh, 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 something in pancakes or something. Maybe. I'm... It should have been. Random spoons. 
That's what Kobe said. It should have been. Marty oh, Ball's meatloaf and waffles. waffles. Yeah. Oh, it said chicken and waffles. Meatloaf and waffles. That's what it was, yeah. Random spoons. <laughs> okay, an episode where Dragonfly Jones fought with Kenji at Nipsey's Dragon at Nipsey's Dragonfly picked up a beer bottle and smacked who over the head? Nipsey? I don't know. I never liked those episodes. I always Are those scenes probably. Yeah, with Dragonfly Jones. I don't know yeah. why. Yeah. I mean he's not it's, it's not, not the funniest. Thing. Yeah. But he smacked himself with a beer bottle. Oh. Yeah, himself, yeah. Uh, who witnessed the bank robbery and had to be placed in witness protection? Protection. Pam? I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about Fresh Prince. Was it Pam? Was that when the FBI was in, using her apartment to look for somebody? Maybe. Gina oh, and Gina Pam. Pam. Okay. Gina and Pam were standing outside the bank when Donnie and Clyde had just finished robbing it. Otis was sent to be their security and appeared to be more of a danger to Gina and Pam as well as himself than Donnie and Clyde. After all was said and done, Otis caught the bad guys when they came to Pam's house pretending to be her and Gina's boyfriends. Otis took the money and went to an island where he was spending it all on the island woman. Okay. All right. Martin and Tommy had a fight over a suitcase, yeah. which ended their friendship. In an effort mm-hmm. to get them back together, the gang invited both Tommy and Martin to the movies. When the two of them saw each other, they bickered back and forth. What was the name of the patron who they made a Extremely mad. What? I don't know. Oh, uh, Ma- I know that Miss Waters. I mean, what's the name? Myra, the old lady. Myra, is that that's not her name? Oh, mm, you're making up. Oh, aggravated man. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do remember? Aggravated oh, nothing. Sit your behind down. Yeah, before I may yeah. change <laughs> him. <laughs> yeah, aggravated man. Yeah. Okay. Mark. Oh, at the movies. Okay, now I remember. Uh, Martin had a crush on a school teacher when he was young. What was the name of the teacher? I remember this episode, but I don't know. Yes. It was Gina was ready to square up on his leg. Yeah. Uh, hmm. I should know that too. Oh, Miss Trinidad. Trinidad. Yeah. Oh, was Shriven. All right. Martin, Gina, Tommy, Cole, and Pam had one had won a four wheel drive SUV. They decided to share the truck, and each person would have use of it on a certain day. Who had use? Of it on, on Wednesday, which is considered hump day. I don't know. Oh, I don't even remember the episode, yeah. Pam. Mm-hmm. Uh, Pam had it on hump day. The reason behind it was that Pam had a large backside, which resembled a hump. Okay. I'm going to look that episode up because I'm like, what? Oh, yeah. This is season one for sure. Yeah, because all of them uh, uh, took scenes driving the car. Um, like in one scene, uh, you know. Cole's driving. Some people, were, certain people, were in the back, mm-hmm. but not not with each other. Mm-hmm. So a different scene. Like uh, um, Gina had to take, you know, uh, Shanae and her friends, or something like that. Oh. Cole had to, Tommy had to take Shanae and her friends, something like that. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. <clears throat> um, okay, last one for Martin. Uh, Martin, Tommy, and Cole made a bet that they could outcook Pam and Gina for Thanksgiving. Cole was told to make the cake. What did he put in the cake to enhance the flavor? He's drawing. <laughs> You gotta put the drawers in it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 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 Okay, that was good. How'd you think you did? I think I did pretty well. I mean, we didn't really tell you, but I think I, I'm, I'm well versed in Martin. Yeah, I think, I, did, I think we did pretty good. I mm-hmm. now want to go watch Martin. That's for sure. I know, right? Even though <laughs> it's still one of our top shows. Yeah, time. top shows to watch. We, we played it all the time. All right, let's try Fresh Prince. Let's see. Uh, what city was Will from? New York, Philadelphia, Detroit, Atlanta. West Philadelphia. Born and raised. <laughs> I'm the playground was for most of these days. Yes, yeah, Philadelphia. Okay, gotcha. Okay. Uh, what is the order of Phil and Vivian's children from oldest to youngest? Uh, Hillary. Will Smith. you marry? Hillary, Carlton, then Ashley. <laughs> no. The order of Phil and Vivian's children from Otis Youngest. Why you only name three people? <laughs> oh, yeah, the name is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, you right. Will got to be in there somewhere. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> they have four children. Hillary, Carlton, Ashley, and the baby. What's the baby name? <laughs> What's that baby name? Nikki. Nikki. Yeah, I'm about to say, I know he has the boys to men middle name. Yes. Nathan Michael Sean Marnier. I think it's that order. 
Um, yes. And then Will would be under Ashley, but before Carlton, if they come. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay. All right. Okay. Let's see here. Um, who is Will's best friend? Jazz. Jazz. DJ Jazz. D D D D D D DJ Jazzy Jeff. Um, what was Jeffrey's last name? That's a good one. That's a good one. I know this one. What is it? Yeah. No. Butler. Really? <laughs> yes. Whoa. Jeffrey's last name is Butler. <clears throat> Um, which character did James Avery play on the show? Uncle Phil. Uncle Phil. Okay, mm-hmm. okay. Uh, what sport did Ashley play when she was younger? Tennis. I think it was tennis. I want to say it was tennis. Yeah. Uh, what was Uncle Phil's profession? Lawyer, attorney. He was an attorney. Uncle Phil attorney. Oh, and a judge. Oh, he eventually became a judge. Yeah. 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 Okay. Of these four, yeah, judge would be the answer. Yes. Okay. Let's see here. Probably didn't answer it. Yeah. yeah. What college did Will and Carlton go to? Um, it was in Cali, uh, not Cal State. No, it wasn't actual college. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, you know? No, what is it? Um, so I know it's similar to UCLA, but it's not those. Yeah. Words. So it's, let's look, but they have options. Uh, ULA. ULA? Okay. Yep, yep. Yep, ULA, yep. Um, what was the ULA mascot? The peacock. Peacock. That's <laughs> Carlton with the peacock. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, and that episode when he was, uh, um, when they kidnapped him. Yeah. And then Will had to be the peacock. Mm-hmm. Remember? Uh, what was the name of Alfonso Ribeiro's character? Carlton. Carlton Banks. Okay, got it. Uh, what was Hillary's fiance's name? Oh, Trevor. Hey, show us. <laughs> Will you? Yeah. <laughs> yes, Trevor. Yes. What was Trevor doing when he proposed to Hillary? Dying. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think dying is going to be one of the options they have here. Okay. All right. It was a bunch bungee uh, jumping he incident. Wants to, he wants to bungee jump. <laughs> While proposing yes. on live television. <laughs> they broke character on those too. <laughs> yeah. We have to go back and watch these. Yeah. Wait, who who was it where somebody had to like grab their head because they was about to laugh that hard? I don't They're know. Trying, I think it was. Uh, I'm going to have to go back and see. Bruh. Hilarious. Yes, bungee jumping. What sport did Will and Carlton play together? Basketball. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Will and Carlton want to take the last shot? Do uh-huh. you hear uh, what job did Hillary have before she hosted her own talk show? Caterer? She was a caterer. Um, she posed a playboy. Yeah. Uh, um, she was an assistant to, uh, what you call him's character? Um, oh, Queen Latifah? Yeah, Queen Latifah. Mm-hmm. She got a lot of jobs, actually. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Of weather these, girl. She was a weather girl. Yeah. Of these, yeah, weather girl, receptionist, personal shopper. Fashion design. Probably yeah, was a girl, girl, yeah. Uh, who was Will's fiance? Neil Long. I knew you were going to say Neil Long. <laughs> they want the character name, Paige. What is this girl's name? Okay. You want to give options? Yes. Let me see. Lisa. Lisa, Lisa Laura, Lauren. Lisa, Lisa. yes. Yeah. Lisa was Will's fiance. Played by Neil Long. <laughs> When Will returned to Philadelphia to find a sandwich named after him, uh-huh. what animal did they use to refer to him? Mm. Let's see the options. Oh. Chicken Will? Yeah, Chicken Will. Yeah. Because he ran. Uh, which famous model played Will's old friend, Jackie? Tyra Banks. Yes. The yes, Tyra yes. Banks. Not the. <laughs> I don't know. Living Legends, you know. The Tyra Banks. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. What was Aunt Viv's profession? Higher ed professor. Come mm-hmm. on. Mm-hmm. Shout, shout out. out, shout out, shout out. <laughs> you know how we do. You know. <laughs> yeah, she's a professor of uh, like black I, history or something. Yeah, something like that. Which of these characters were replaced on the show? Okay, well, we got another options. Ashley, Hilly, Jeffrey, Aunt Viv. Aunt Viv. I love both. Yes, yes. Yeah. Three seasons of both. I love, I love both. 
Um, so which of these actresses appeared on the show? Okay. Halle Berry, Queen Latifah, Angela Bassett, Jada Pinkett. Which oh, Queen Latifah we just said. Yes, Queen Latifah appeared. Jada Pinkett did appear on there, right? No. No. No, she she wanted to play the part of who Nia Long ended up playing. His girlfriend, his actual girlfriend. But that's where they met at the Yeah, she she was never on the show. Oh, I'm thinking of um remember what you call from a different world? I was thinking her character. Okay, Queen Latifah. From a different world, which one? Oh, the um the main character. The main yeah, yeah, main yeah, chick yeah. from different world. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Jasmine Guy. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I was yeah, thinking yeah. her. Yeah, okay. she did, yeah. She cause she was in she was in college. Mm-hmm. On the on the uh yes, Queen Latifah ended up playing two different characters on the show. Yeah. She was uh she played a love interest. Yeah, at one point. when they were in high school and she played yes. Hillary's, Hillary's boss. Uh, boss. Yes. Yeah, at a different time, yeah. Uh, on what show did Phil propose? On what show did Phil propose to Vivian? Soul Train. Soul Train. <laughs> you heard me? Yeah. Which character is known for their dancing? For their dancing, Carlson. Yes. Mm-hmm. No. That's how it goes. Okay. okay. Let me see what you got. I am not gonna you know do what? that. I ain't stressing. <laughs> I, I could do that right. one. Okay. I could do that one. <laughs> Shut up, dear Silas, man. Uh, yes, Carlson. Carlson's known for his dancing. Uh, who was Carlton's favorite singer? Oh, I... Song? Yes. Uh, you want me to sing the song? No. It's not <laughs> unusual to you. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, no. Y'all look at the options? Yes. It's not unusual. You hear my son singing in the background? Ellen John, Prince, Michael Jackson, Tom Jones. Tom Jones. Tom Jones. Yes. Of course. Of these. Which character's first line on the show was, Dad, I need $300. I need your dollars. Dad, I need your dollars. Hillary. Hillary <laughs> Banks, yes. Who performed at Nikki's christening? Boys to Men. Boy, bo- boys to Men. Goodness, your favorite. Come on now, come on now. That's easy, that's easy, that's easy. Which of these men appeared on the show attempting to buy the Banks mansion? Let's see. Who tried to buy that mansion? I ain't gonna say it. Bill Gates, Tom Hanks, Regis Philbin, or Donald Trump? Donald Trump. Was uh, the 45th president of these years. We'll skip that one. The who? The 45th president of Which fictional couple bought the Banks Mansion at the end of the series? You want me to look? Yeah. Carl and Harry Winslow, George and... uh, Louise. Jefferson. George Louise Jefferson. Martin and Gina Payne or Heathcliff and Claire Huxtable? The Jeffersons. The Jeffersons did, yes. Yeah. Even though he played the judge. Yeah. Already. Yeah. You know, like I uh, ran him when they did the... Speaking yeah. of which, and he was in Fresh Prince in DMV Blue. I mean, uh, Martin, DMV Blue. He was! Hilarious. Speaking of DMV, I gotta go this week. Please remind me. He's going tomorrow. <laughs> I know you don't feel like it, but that's fine. I don't. <laughs> What city do Hillary and Ashley move to at the end of the show? New York. Yeah, I think it's New York. Yeah, definitely at the East. It's definitely New York. When John Witherspoon got lost with Will in the middle of the woods, what did Will leave as a trail to lead back to him? Now, I do remember this because that's that was somebody's dad. Lisa's dad. No, Lisa's dad wasn't played by John Witherspoon. It was another person. Oh, was yeah. The dad from um, uh, Good Times. Good Times play, yeah. Mm-hmm. This is that. Um, but what do you leave as a trail to lead back to him? Let me see. What are the options? Some of these leaves, hot sauce, crackers. I don't know. All right, we're going to have to skip that one to come back to it. Oh, hot sauce. When Will's recovering in the hospital, what show does he reveal he knows all the words to? Young and Wrestling? I don't know that one. I don't know that either. The options are Good Times, Jefferson's, What's Happening, Different Strokes. Y'all tell us. <laughs> I don't know that one. I'm going to say Good Probably Times. Good Times, yeah. Probably Good Times. When Will meets an older pregnant woman, played by Vanessa Williams, where does she she go into labor? In the limo outside in, the game. Yes. Mm-hmm. In the car, yeah. Mm-hmm. When Will arrives late to his bachelor party, what does he find pretending to be him? Well, or who does he find pretending to be him? Jeffrey? I don't know. I think it's Carlson. Or Jazz. Jazz. Probably Jazz. Probably jazz. Probably jazz. Probably jazz. 
Okay, uh, in the theme song, what line comes after? And a couple of guys they that were up to no good, good. Started, started making trouble in my neighborhood. neighborhood. I got one little fight, my mom got scared. She said, what would y'all say on Bill and Billy? Okay. I was a fuck. <laughs> no. <laughs> what? Uh, uh. Begged and pleaded with me. Uh, I begged and pleaded with her. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's the full one. The full one, one yeah. Uh, who's the first person to find out that Hillary dropped out of college? Will. Will did, yes. Yes. Because then that's what he held, held over her head. And then, uh-huh. Yeah. Bing, ding, ding, ding. Oh, no, that was... And was making her like do all that, that yeah, stuff? Yeah. yeah. Uh, Wash your dirty drawers. Oh, you said, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, no, then... um. Uh, Carlton said, uh, "Does he make does he make you wash your uh, uh, wash his clothes?" Uh, is it yeah. No, no. no yeah. What are we gonna do? No. What do you do, mine? Will you wash mine? <laughs> okay, yes, I will do. Uh, which duo is known for their famous dance to the Sugar Hill Gang song Apache? What? I think that's. Oh, boom. Oh, oh, boom. oh, uh, Carlton and Will. Yeah. I was like, yeah. <laughs> mm. Okay, that's it. I think we do it now. Better than the better I, than the first. I, one. I agree. I agree. I think we did better than. Oh wait, better than the first Fresh Prince one that we tried. Yes. Yeah, that one's terrible. I also think we did better than Martin, Martin tribute. I know. I didn't. I didn't. I knew I would do well on the Martin one because we watch that all the time. Yeah. We watch Fresh Prince a lot, but not as often. Yeah, no, so no, I didn't even awesome. know that I knew all of those. Yeah. 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 It definitely makes us want to go back and watch those for sure. Being black in the nineties. Yeah, man. We gonna do some more trivia. Uh, living single. We gotta catch up on. We got. I gotta mm-hmm. go. Me, 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 me personally. Yeah. I gotta catch up on living single. No <laughs> uh, what else shows could we? Oh, you guys let us know. Okay. Uh, you're being summoned. Nah, da. Da, da. Any last words, poop? Thank you guys for taking the stage with us once again. <laughs> the, the mic is literally catching all of this. Thank you guys for taking the stage with us. Once again, um, this was fun. This was refreshing. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And shout out to moms watching the kids all week. Shout know, out moms. Yeah. Get to do this Mama Carlotta. earlier than like midnight yeah, or five o'clock five. in the morning. <laughs> right, right. Yeah, shout out moms. Both of our moms. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. I think next episode will probably be about vacation. Okay, I'm coming, boy. All right, let's go. Bye. Have a good one. Thank you for taking the stage. Do you use my outro like that? You asked this last episode. Oh. And I said, sometimes I do. Oh. Sometimes you people be over here. <laughs> yeah, you do. Sometimes say you that. be right here. Oh, yeah. This ain't even the right camera. You be like, here. this camera. You're right. right here. Look at these. They got five cameras on this. <laughs> Hey, podcasters. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and TikTok. You can also listen to our audio podcast on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, or wherever you get your podcasts. Have a good one.